Hello friends and welcome to Knowledge by Nature. I really wanted to film outside today, but as you can see, the weather or slash the wind would not cooperate with me. I even tried to record an intro and the wind was so loud you couldn't even hear me. So again, it's beautiful. I'm getting some gorgeous fall colors right now, but it just is not cooperating for a filming today. So let's go in. Let's do a book haul, guys. It's so good to see you. Come on. All right, guys, we are sort of inside. I'm out here in my sunroom and it's still like a little bit windy sounding, but I think we should be fine for the video. But I have a book outlet haul that we're gonna be checking out. And then I also ordered this from Etsy and I wanted to show you that. But also look how cute this little pumpkin is. I just think it's so cute. Um, my mom got this for me and it's made out of like old pallet boards and painted and it's adorable. And I love fall so much. It's my favorite time of year and I just have missed you guys. I hope everybody's doing good and I'm just so glad to be making another video. And so I ordered this box back in August and I got it at the end of August, I believe. But then my parents came to see me, then we all got sick. And so I really don't know what's in this. So that's gonna be kind of exciting for all of us. So let's get started. Before we do, if this is your first time here, I am a homeschool mom to a wonderful little first grader. And most of my channel is about homeschool and all the curriculum that we use and all the things that we do. And so if you haven't joined me already, I ask that you hit that subscribe button. And if you like this type of video, give me a thumbs up. Let's get into this. I did mention that we've been sick and my voice definitely still sounds stuffy so I'm sorry if that is annoying to you I hope I'm almost over all of this but look at this little cute thing I ordered from Etsy she had been really interested in getting like into sewing and I put this on my Instagram so you might have seen that it has like this little ring and it came with I think two pieces of burlap that came with the order with this yarn. It came with this little like needle also, but it's not, it's like a dull needle, a dull plastic needle. But while I was placing the order, I went ahead and ordered a few extra burlap pieces too, so that we would have them. But I thought this was so cute. And this is like a little beginner sewing kit on Etsy. And I thought it was adorable and had to order it. The reason that I included that in with this is because I think I was thinking some of those ideas when I placed this. So I don't even know if I have any books in here to be honest, but let's check it out. If you've seen any of my videos, you probably have seen me do a book outlet haul. I really, really like book outlet. It's very affordable, especially if you get over that $35 where you get free shipping. If you're just going on there for like one or two books, then it's probably not a huge savings because then you're gonna have to pay the shipping. But if you get the free shipping and then a lot of times there's like, Wow, the wind is just so crazy today. Um, hopefully you can still hear me. But I will also put my referral link down in the bottom. I think it gets you like $10 off a purchase of 20 or 25. I can't remember. I'll put that down in the description. But um, if you haven't ever used Book Outlet before, definitely check them out. It's really, really nice way to get some very affordable books. Oh! Okay, so see, I told you that I really don't remember what I got in here. So they have, and that's one of the really cool things I just recently found is that the book outlet has more than books. And so that's why I don't even know if I got any books on this one, because I know I was thinking like kind of hands-on things. And so I got the Ultimate Vortex Generator. 
and this just looks really neat. You can put stuff on, you can make these mixtures of stuff, put them in the little beaker that it comes with, turn this on, and it kind of like mixes up. It says 1648 on there. That's not what I paid for it. I'm thinking like maybe this was nine, eight or nine dollars, maybe not even that much. But this is gonna be something that's really fun. She's going to enjoy this, just adding different things that you can put in there. And so this is all the stuff that it comes with. So that's gonna be fun. Okay, I, ooh. Good, I did get this book. I had forgotten about this. A Children's Introduction to Poetry. This is the whole time I've been ordering from Book Outlet. I've been looking for like some poetry books and I hadn't really found any. Um, but I did find this one this time and it looks like there's a CD. It says, Hear the Poems Come to Life on the Audio CD as Read by Professional Actors. Oh, that's really neat. Super cool. And then just kind of looking at this. Okay. Oh, cute. Oh. So it looks like it kind of tells you a little bit about some poems and then it gives you a poem. Oh, well, this is very neat. This is very neat. I'm going to have to definitely check this out a lot more, but especially for like poetry tea times, because that's something that she really likes. A lot of times we don't actually have poetry in it. And so um, I thought it would be cool to at least have a few poems because we have the sing a song of seasons that we read every night and she really likes that. And so I thought it would be really neat to have another poem book. And so this is a pretty neat little book that I'm excited to get more into. Okay. Oop, I have another book here. What was the first Thanksgiving? It says 16 pages of photos inside. So knowing that, you know, Thanksgiving is right around the corner. There was the pictures. So there's like some real pictures there. The drawings and things. That's, that's neat. So knowing that, you know, Thanksgiving is not that far from us, um, I had in mind to get this. So I'm glad I grabbed that. So I don't have, I didn't order a ton of stuff this time. Oh, and I have, I ordered these. Yeah, see, everything is just such a surprise for me right now. And then I see I have a few more things here, but I have a wipe, excuse me, I have write on wipe off edition and some traction cards. And I have never seen these before and I don't even know if they're any good, but it says 40 write on wipe off cards and one non-toxic pen with an eraser. When I saw these, I thought, I'm actually gonna open them. Let's open them. When I saw these, I thought that they would just be a really good thing to include in like a basket, um, like a morning basket, or even just being able to do them on game school days or just a different time. So hold on, that did not actually cut, just a minute. All right, so they are, oh, okay. Um, it's in a really nice little box. And then as you can see, it holds the cards here and it holds the marker with a little eraser. So that's neat. And then let's just pull, oh yeah. So this is gonna be really nice to just be able to like give her a few cards to do. And so on the back, it has the answers to the sheet on the front. So it could even be kind of check your own answers. And as you can see, it goes from, you know, fairly easy to simpler, like maybe first grade-ish up to, would go quite a few grades here. It goes ages six to eight. If I pull from the back, okay, as I pull from the back, you can see that, you know, we're getting into larger double digit numbers there. And I see that they're color coded. So like these were green, and then I'm seeing some blue ones here. And I don't know. Color, cards are color coded to indicate level. Green is easy, blue is more challenging, and orange offers the ultimate test of mathematical mastery. 
So that's pretty cool. And I really like the box that it came in. Like it's really, that's a good quality. Um, good quality box. This should hold up quite well. So we have both the addition and the subtraction ones. And so that is just, I think this is a great addition to our math manipulatives and math resources. And then the very last thing that I have here is a DIY bath bombs. This will be probably pretty fun and it looks like it comes with a little booklet on maybe how to make these bath bombs. So this is something that she's never done before. She does like using bath bombs. And again, I was trying to come up with some interactive options, some play stem sort of things to add to this fall. And so I thought this would be really fun. And so we have, what all does it come with? Um, okay, so it comes with like the mix, and some molds and the dyes. So this will be another little fun STEM activity that we can add in. And I'm wondering if it's like something after we've used it all, I wonder if I can figure out how to make more with some other ingredients maybe since we have the molds and everything. So that'll be fun. So this is a really small haul. To be honest, it, it needed to be. I've kind of been ordering a lot of books lately. They're so addictive, it's hard not to. But it's really not that long before Christmas is upon us. And so I'm going to try to slow down these hauls and things for a little bit so that I have a few things that I will have left over to give for Christmas and things like that. Um, I do have one more possible haul. I don't know if you guys would want to see it. If you do, put it down in the comments below because I brought up a bunch of books that I had down in storage. And so I kind of had some thrift books also. So if you wanna see like some of the books that I was able to pick up thrift books, some of them are kids books, some of them are adult books. So if you wanna see kind of that random, like pulled from, 20 year storage books, uh, put that down in the comments too. I'd be happy to do that. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. It's so good to be back. Um, I'm hoping to have two videos for you this week. So that makes it even better. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.